Before having this disease, I had a very busy life. I was always outside playing with my friends. I was spending time with my brothers, my family. I was playing different sports such as field hockey, track, soccer, and after I got sick, things just kind of fell apart. I was actually pretty scared because I couldn't even get out of bed in the morning. We discovered Hannah was coming to us telling us she had diarrhea. Well, we noticed in the diarrhea that there was a little bit of blood, so we called her doctor, and the doctor sent us to a GI specialist so we can get some further treatment to see what else was going on. She also was getting tired. She was laying in bed a lot. She'd spent her entire day in bed. We were, we were starting to worry about her. Uh, family members were concerned because they were saying she doesn't look like herself anymore. She was becoming pale and a lot of stuff. Everybody was worried about her. As things started, started to get worse, not only did my family get scared, but I got scared because I didn't know what was going on. I didn't know what was happening. One day she woke up and her foot was completely swollen out of the blue. So I called her doctor. They got her in the following Monday. She took one look at Hannah. She knows Hannah. She's been with Hannah since she was born. And she said something's not right. So I took her the next morning to get her blood work done. Went to the lab, had the work done. I dropped her off at home with her dad. And then I went to work. As soon as I got to work, my cell phone rang. I answered it. It was my doctor telling me to um, take her to Hershey Medical Center. ER, they're waiting for her immediately. Dr. Folier comes in, we meet her for the first time, and she looks over Hannah and decides to start her off with some blood, get her back up on her blood, because I guess she got her results back from some of the blood tests that she was really low. When she walked into my room and and told me that she was one of the doctors at Penn State Hershey IBD Center, I felt a huge wave of relief wash over me knowing that there were people that knew what they were doing and were caring for me. She said hopefully by the end of the week we'll be able to get her an upper and a lower GI just to figure out what is going on with Hannah and we'll take great care of her. I've had little knowledge on any of this. I didn't even know Crohn's existed until she started having these issues and coming to Penn State's IBD Center for Pediatrics has made a difference. Hannah is back to Hannah. We are just happy that we came to the IBD Center. After finding out I had this disease and after my treatment at Penn State Hershey IBD Center, I felt amazing. I could finally do field hockey again. School was starting up again soon, which I'm really excited about. New, brand new teachers, new friends, it's amazing. Mm -hmm.